Uh, Dan scored the uh, winning goal in overtime today for Team Forge. Yeah. Um, what was that uh, experience like out on the pitch? <laughs> yeah, it was great. I think we did well to up to that point to obviously rise up having a good game and uh, getting them to that overtime and that big stop from uh, Monkey to get get us uh, the right men on on the pitch and, and score that goal. Was there a sort of was there any specific plan in that sort of overtime period? Were you looking to anything in particular? Nothing in particular. It's just we've got so much depth, so we just get get the right guys on. Uh, and run those picks down the side and, and uh, obviously people moving off ball gets us that look inside so which we got How uh, did you find the uh, sixes format in general? Yeah it's uh, quick very quick uh, tough to adapt to but I'm, after this so, so towards the second half we were I think we've, think we've got the hang of it now, so uh, moving forward we'll, we yeah, should be on it. Yeah, quite a change. In the first half it was maybe a yeah. bit frantic from both teams, and yeah. then after the break the sort of the standard uh, lifted, did you sort of feel that? Yeah, definitely. Bit? I think you, it's only 30 seconds, but it's a lot more time than you think, and it's the same with like box lacrosse. You, you've got time to get your, your, your guys on and then spin the ball and get through a couple of sets and get a good look. It's about taking that right, right chance inside and, and making the goalie work. And do you think after that first game now you've got a good base and there's plenty there to work on? Oh yeah. Sort of know what you're going to do a bit better now going forward. Yeah, in the next couple definitely. Of like I said, we've got so much depth and people can go both ways. So uh, yeah, we, we've got plenty to uh, plenty to build on there and uh, take it. You know, move, moving forward, we'll hopefully win the next two games.